You don't know binary search unless you can do this. And yes, this will be code question is number 69. Haha. <laughs> Our function needs to get the square root of x. However, you can't use the power function and you can't use any sort of exponents. So how do you do this? Binary search is commonly used to scan a list of numbers, but it can also be used to scan a range of numbers. If we want the square root of x, well, it's going to be somewhere between l and r or between 1 and x. While l is less than or equal to r, you'll get the middle value is l plus r over 2. However, you're not searching for some target you're searching for the square root. If you take m times m and that is equal to x, that must mean that the square root of x is m. That is our square root, and so we return it. If it's not equal to x, then it must be less than it or it must be greater than it. If m squared is less than x, that means we can discard the left side and only look at the right side. We set l to be m plus 1. Otherwise, m squared must be bigger than x. That means our m value is too big. So we set r to be m minus 1. Every time we divide the range we're looking at in 2, which results in logarithmic time. 